It's tax day. I'm doing my taxes. F <laughs> taxes. There's a news update here in Green Bay. The Taco Bell on West Mason has exploded. There's some sort of explosion uh, at the Taco Bell on West Mason. It's completely roped off. There's police everywhere. It's 70, oh, it's 80 degrees now. Holy sh shit balls. It's 80 degrees here in Green Bay, Wisconsin. You know, it's April 18th, Uncle Sam called and he said, hey, how much money do you have in your bank account, Jeff? And I was like, I don't have much, Uncle Sam. And he's like, I want $3,000 more than that. And I said, why? why, Uncle Sam, why? Why would you do this to me? Why would you do these horrible things to me? And he said, go f yourself. Huh? <gasps> Working in the shop. I've got this really old desk. It's just kind of beat up. It's got a lot of stains on it. A little gnarly looking. But it's huge, which I love. Here's all the drawers for it. So it was hand built and then I sort of customized it as well. So what'll happen is I'm gonna take off all the hardware Take off all these handles, all that kind of junk. Right, so the first thing is to strip it with some mineral spirits. Let's get some stripping done. We are go for liftoff in T minus 30. 008 clear to runway 04, wind at 030 degrees. All right, I've got some cracks in the edges that I'm gonna try and attempt to fix up with some wood Roger that, Houston. All systems five by five. All systems are a go. Started on this corner, worked all the way down. Oh my the other side. Now we've gotta get Focus first. Now we have to get down to sanding it. All right, let's do this. Oh my! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Oh! Oh! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Oh! Oh! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Oh! Oh my! Oh my goodness! I to break up your party, Steve, but we seem to be having on a problem here. Is that? Are you there? Basically last night I just kept adding layers and layers and layers of stain onto the top of this. I did about, boy, I did about six coats and then I sanded this morning with a very fine grit Sandpaper, this is the three four hundred. And this edge where I touched up, uh, you can see where I touched it up, which I actually think I think it looks kind of cool. I think that'll be kind of a cool effect. 
So I want to just keep throwing stain on this side and along this edge. And you can see there's another filler spot right there, which look I think it looks kind of cool. And then I will be using um, this Howard uh, Feed and Wax wood polish and conditioner to finish the job. The fronts of these drawers are looking real nice. Shined up. I haven't even sanded these yet. So there's one on this side and there's one that pulls out over there as well. So I got those stained and these I'm actually gonna use the wax on as well. I'm using the wax on all the top surfaces. Everything else I'm gonna leave it as is. Alright, it's time to get these little separators glued in because before I just had them sitting in here loose, which works, but I would rather have them be just like stuck in there. Solid. Now to make sure that this furniture stays in good condition for a long period of time as I'm restoring it, that's the whole purpose. Uh, but in order to make sure that this furniture lives long and prospers, I put a spock on the bottom of each drawer. Okay, so I have the brass handles here. They're sitting in a solution, which is just plain old white vinegar. Ba -ba 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 -ba. And then I just stirred in a bunch of salt. So that's all that is in there. You just have to keep stirring it until the salt is totally dissolved. They're pretty beat up looking. Rinse it off with the water. Get some baking soda. I want to get a bunch of that on there. And then I'm going to scrub. Yeah, so look at the difference there. Bam! Alright, I'm going to do this to all of them. Get them all cleaned up. Pretty frickin' clean. Good old faithful stubby. Stubby Stubberton. Good as new. It's beautiful. I've sanded everything off. Stain is how I want it. Um, I am now going to apply this feed and wax, uh, which is just a rag. I'm just going to put it on a rag and apply it. This is the final step. So here we go.